hi everyone welcome to my channel today i'll be giving you guys a really quick look at some of the items i found on my most recent trip to tuesday morning i went in looking specifically for the three punches i've been seeing on a lot of haul videos but i was only able to find these two the one that i really wanted also would be the butterfly punch but they did not have that at my store but i did find this one this is the extra large deco edge punch and I also found the star punch and that would be the next one I'll show you guys and you do get I think there's like four different sizes of stars once you punch them out actually five and I will go ahead and remove the price sticker so you can see what the what the actual punch size looks like Now they did have a lot of other Fiskars punches, but these are just the two that I picked up. I also needed some of these paper clips, these flags for my Happy Planners. So I saw them for $1.99 and there are like eight of them in the package. So I went ahead and grabbed these as well. And I also picked up these cute alphas. Lately, I've been loving the wood grain look for alphas. I've been using those a lot on my layouts. And when I saw these, I knew I wanted them. These are definitely smaller than the ones I have. And these are from the Again and Again collection by Pink Paisley. So I grabbed two packages of those. And I am just moving things around right now just to avoid the glare from my light. So here we have from the Flourish collection, these stickers and there are four sheets all together. There are some word phrases, some labels, as you can see there. There's also some alphas and I will go ahead and open it up and have you take a look. Now, crepe paper, Maggie Holmes, they're usually cream based and I do not have any more of the Flourish collection. I don't think in my stash, but these definitely will go with a lot of the other crepe paper collections and they are pretty neutral those gold alphas will pretty much go with anything so i went ahead and grabbed that package here we have these cute little flowers and these are burlap flowers so i picked up a pack of those and one of these as well these have some butterflies in there and they were all different shades of burlap but i love those colors those are very neutral So I was so excited to find these Jane Davenport stamps at my store. I grabbed these two stamps. This one you're looking at is called Girl Group. And here we have the second stamp is called Hairlines. So next up, we have these stamps from Bow Bunny. This one is called Wall to Wall Textures. And I got this mostly for the wood grain stamp on the top. But I love all of them and I'll be using those mostly on my art journal layouts. I also saw these stamps, this, uh, this set is called Positive Vibes and I just love the cameras and the size of these stamps. I also love the flip film reels as well. And here we have some cute bows from Heidi Swap. They also had some other colors, blues, teals and hot pinks but i went with the neutral black and white set so here we have some binder rings i got to make my own mini albums i love making my own albums and i always need more binder rings so i got the black ones and i also got these as well these are like a gunmetal color or pewter so I grabbed one of each and then I got these embellishments from, I believe this is from Dale Lizzie. Yes, it is. And I got it mostly for those balloons and those little clusters to the top and the hearts. The one that says best ever and the one that says sweetness. Not sure if I'll use the hands, but this is from the it's all good collection i do not have any other items from this collection in my stash but it will most likely go with other dear lizzie collections that i have so there you have it a very quick haul from tuesday morning i will go ahead and 
add these items that I show you guys today in my description box if you wanted to check it out online if you do not have one of these stores close by. So I want to thank you all for watching today and until my next video, bye!